Hello guys, share out to everybody. So we have a brief video from a diehard Marcos loyalist. So this is all about the fundamental form of our government. And I hope you can understand everything of what he said in this video. And thank you for tuning in to our channel. Mabuhay po kayo. Ako bilang loyalista, ako ay meron sasabihin para sa Pangulo. Dahil sa kanyang ipinangako, 20 pesos per kilo ng bigas bago siya maupo. Nangangamu niya pa lamang siya sa inangangalap ng mga salita na kanyang binitawan, na kanyang ipinangako sa 115 million Filipinos that the rice will be goes down to 20 pesos per kilo and he will do that as a promise. But later after the election, later after the year of duties to serve the country and to serve the people, mostly is for the people, where is that promises that has been made to be broken. And as far as I hear the current news, Mr. President, do not blame the farmers. Do not blame those people. What happening of the harvest of the local product of the rice, that is not the excuse to increase the price of the rice. Because Mr. President, you are the head of the agriculture. You should know how to deal with the farmers, not to use them as the small people. Because without the farmers, our country will still falling down deep because of the local products did not increase at all. So I'm trying to say here, because of this, some typhoons happen. Because you guys did not help the farmers with the right process of their rice planting, it was damaged. And now during your sauna, during your speech, it sounds to me that you do not give any good attention the farmers to be helped. I remember the words you have said before, do not use the farmers. Sa halip ay tulungan natin. But if you are a very good president for what you have said, speaking from your mouth, 20 pesos per kilo, it should be implemented because you have the power for the National Food Authority, what is called the NFA, that there is tax of rice locally, that you can use that to keep that down instead na mabulok yan dyan sa bodega, sana ay pinamigay mo na lang sa ating mga kababayang nagugutong. Sa 20 pesos that you could recover that instead of you are asking importing the rice from other country, which is more risk for our people. Because all those private company who are using the tarifa of, of the government for them to benefit, which is there is a self-interest by the agriculture department, that you should be monitored. Keep an eye to those privatization of this administration, Mr. President Ferdinand Bongbong Marcos Pino. But indeed, we hear your promises. Your promise is for the people, not for yourself. Your promise is not for the country. It's not for yourself. This is for the people. Now, I am a Marcos lawyer lease from your father. But for you, being the leader of the republic, for what you promise for the people in the please do so. So that the people will give back what is the responsibility of the president to implement what is needed to be done. But never did happen. Instead, the farmers not getting enough help provide a good help for our needs. The people needs our local products so that it helps also your economy instead of the private sector to use the governments for them to benefit for what the people needs. 